Hi everyone, it's Mel here and welcome back to Mel's Blind Life, the YouTube channel all about blindness and welcome to a cooking video. It's Monday, so it's cooking time or food time depending on whether I'm doing a grocery haul. Anyway, we are going to try something that we have never tried before. I'm going to go where I have never been before and try this recipe. <clears throat> it is cake in a cup. Dun, dun, dun. On my kitchen bench here, you can see the sachet of cake in a cup. Or does it go around that way? Don't know. I think this is a double chocolate fudge. I can't remember now. It's so long since I bought these at the supermarket. Um, and I've only just rediscovered it in the bottom of my pantry. So I'm going to try it today. So I have my sachet of cake in a cup. And I also have my big cup here this is quite a large mug it's um a the outside of it is a map of the golden princess which is my favorite cruise ship so what we're going to do is we're going to tear the sachet you can see i've already started and then we're going to pour it into the cup so i've got my sachet torn open i'm going to line it up and I'm going to tip it in to the mug, move it away. Ooh, and there's lots and lots of powder in there. Can you see? Now I'm going to have to dig in the powder because I'm not sure whether it has a little sachet of icing. I can't remember or not whether it's meant to digging in the powder and I can't see anything. Mm. Chocolatey. So now I need to get, I think it was two tablespoons of milk and put that in the cup too. So I've got my spoon and I'm gonna grab some milk. So now I've got my cake mixture and my milk in my cup. I just grabbed a measuring spoon and measured out the milk. I'm going to grab a fork and I'm going to beat the cake. So now our cake is stirred until there's no lumps in it. There's no handle on this mug. Oh, there it is. So the cake is stirred until there are no lumps in it. We're going to go to the microwave with the cake in the golden princess cup. This cup is really good for making this recipe, I reckon, because as I said earlier, it's moist. I'm going to open the microwave. In you go, Mr. Cake. Good luck. Right. Sit. Now, I'm pretty sure the packet said 60 seconds. Or was it 30? Oh, I'm not sure now. Um, I'll do... Oops. Time 30 and see what happens in 30 seconds time. I'm looking forward to this. This is going to be fun. I wish I could explain to you who aren't watching, if you know what I mean, what the map of the Golden Princess looks like on the cup because it's not, I don't know, it's like an inside view where the walls aren't, well, it's very difficult to explain what it looks like and I don't quite understand it myself but it's very cute having a map on a cup you don't need a map just walk around carrying your Milo okay so it's beeped no way that it's ready in that short a time nope it's just warm cake mix okay 
well. Mm. I wonder if you meant to stir it again. I don't know. I'll put it in for another 60 seconds. Maybe it's meant for 90 seconds. I don't remember now. Note to yourself. Read the destructions next time. Next time I'll either try and read the destructions or remember the, I mean instructions. I've called instructions destructions for hundreds of years. Um, yes, next time I will try and read the destructions or at least remember the destructions before I do this. Could be very interesting. <clears throat> I don't know, can you see inside a microwave when it's microwaving? I don't know. Cooking, cooking, cooking. <laughs> Can't smell baked cake smell yet. Always important when you've been cooking to put away your instruments. So I'll, oops, hold my hand over the camera, sorry. I'll pick up the rest of the measuring spoons and put them back in the cupboard over here. Mm -hmm. Up there, come on, get up there. Oh, it's beeping at me again. <laughs> oh, I smell baked cake. Oh, it's hot. Oh my gosh, it's risen. And it feels like a cake. Oh, it feels like a risen cake inside a mug. And I think it's cooked. I'll do the old fork trick though. Apparently, if I can find my fork, uh, and we'll see if it's still wet inside. <clears throat> okay. In goes the fork. If it comes out dry, then it means we're cooked. Oh, hang on. I think we're cooked. There's no cake mixture on the fork. I wonder if you can pour the cake out of the cup into a bowl to see what it looks like. <laughs> okay, so I've grabbed a bowl and I'm going to very carefully put the bowl down somewhere. There. Pick up the cake in the Golden Princess cup still, which is quite warm. I'm going to see if I can shake the cake out of the cup into the bowl. But I might change hands with the camera first. Okay. <clears throat> Just like I'm pouring a drink, I'll try and... Okay, maybe not. Oh, wait, 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 here it comes. Shaking. Did you come out? Are you still in the cup? I think not. Oh, look at the little, not quite cooked on the bottom, cake. Oh, look at the cake. Oh, yummy. I think it needs another few seconds in the microwave, though. It's kind of sticky on the outside. Maybe it's meant to be like that. I don't know. Mm. I don't want to overcook it, though. I mean, it looks cooked. It's just a bit sticky on the outside. Let's see whether it tastes cooked. bad at all that's a bit delicious so there you have it a cake in a cup it was very nice it was quite delicious um it was just what i needed actually something sweet something small and something tasty 
I think next time though, um, I will do it for two minutes. Um, my microwave isn't very powerful, so it needed a little bit longer than it had. Um, I did it for 90 seconds all up and I think it needs um, an extra sort of 30 seconds or so. So next time I know that, but it's probably something I will buy and do again because I really enjoyed it. And like I said, it was something small, something sweet, something simple. Um, I might even try it with custard. So make it um, and then put it in a bowl with custard. I think that would be really nice to do again. So I hope that you've enjoyed this little video uh, that you might have learned about something new or that you've just enjoyed me making a fool of myself in the kitchen. I, I don't bake. Um, I made enough cakes in my childhood to know what the consistency of cake mixture should be before you put the cake in the oven. But if you asked me to make a cake out of scratch or from scratch, then I probably wouldn't do it because, um, unless it was something really special, like if I had to make a birthday cake or something like that, I might, but you know, just for something simple to nibble on around the house, I probably know for certain that I wouldn't bake a cake from scratch. I might make a cake out of cake mix that you come out of the packet and just, you have to just add the wet ingredients and then you get that. But I certainly don't think that if I was doing it just for something to do, I don't think that I would make a cake from scratch anymore. I used to when I was little, but now that I'm on my own, that kind of stuff, I don't enjoy cooking as much on my own now because it's only me that I'm doing it for. And I honestly just can't be bothered. So there you go. Anyway, that is something that I will definitely buy again and something that I definitely will do again. Uh, so I hope that you've enjoyed this video, that you may have learned something or just gotten a laugh, as I said, of me making a fool in, of myself in the kitchen, possibly. So I will see you all next video for a grocery haul next week. And please remember to like this video, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to my channel to get more awesome content about all about blindness and uh, let uh, me know in the comment section down below if you've got any questions. And also, if you haven't subscribed, as I said, do that and click the bell notification to find out when I upload my next video. So thank you all very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.